Hi friends, welcome back to another day in my vlog. So today's vlog is just a simple vlog around kids. They're having a midwinter break here. So just what I do when they're home. So this is one kind of workbook for my son. Uh, it's like a tracing, a lot of you know different puzzles and counting work. If this comes in alphabets also, this is numbers and uh, the numbers and tracing. So that's what uh, you know. I do a lot of activities with him. So you can see a lot of tracing, zigzag work, so all those things because he's in pre-K. So I do a lot of this kind of activities for him and these books are from Costco. So it really engages the kids and it's I found it like very helpful because he likes a lot of activities of this kind that engages him. And these are another kinds like hidden pictures you have to find out how many of these are there so it's like a lot of you know mind games and something that helps building their concentration thinking power and a lot of like that things so that's how you know I try to engage them with different activities I know I found find these kind of books at Costco a lot with different activities and it's very uh, uh, reasonably priced like nine dollars or ten or max twelve dollars and these kind of books are wipeable like you can wipe and do as much as you want so these are some of the activities that he got from school during the break time they gave from they gave from school a lot of cutting work to improve his you know handwork here teachers they encourage a lot of scissor skills that helps in writing and pencil control too plus their hand muscles are moving so that's how they work on the hand work so these are sequencing work that he's doing like he has to cut and he has to see the pictures what come first next next another last so he has to stick it there and he has to make a sequence So he likes doing such kind of things. He engages in talking. He creates the stories while looking the pictures, and he tells me how what he will do. And you know, he engages in a lot of talk and uh, work. So that's how I engage him during his things. And also at this age, they enjoy these kind of activities rather than just sitting with the book and pencil. So and they learn by this. So by doing like this, he has learned most of the numbers. And plus now his hand muscles have also grown up well, and he started writing pretty well his letters and numbers too. Plus these kind of thinking activities. Help them develop their thinking and you know, a lot of creativity and a lot of uh, memory skills and everything improves. And also at the end of the work, they feel themselves confident. They feel like yes, I've done this, and uh, it's my work. So what he likes to do is, after he finishes some activity, he loves to see it and he loves to stick it on the wall for some time because he feels happy looking at that. Uh, he's like and if somebody comes home he'll be like see this activity I have done it I sat and did with my mama I cut it he'll tell all the backstories about it and I think that makes them more happy and you know good feeling good about themselves 
So here he wanted to do more of the sequencing work so I gave him one more sheet and you can see he's cutting himself and sticking himself and you know placing in the correct order. And now he is doing some of the counting work like numbers. So here again he has to count the number of uh, pictures given and select the numbers and stick it on the order of count that he has done. So these are different kind of activities you even get it online and even teachers suggest some of these kind of activities for this age group. So I go check out online, I take the print out and you know I just give it to them. They, they like to do all this kind of work. And plus they improve their counting skills, alphabets, they learn, play way through of learn activity. And here she's working on her handwriting work and her school work, the homework that she gets from school. So she she gets to sit uh, by herself and she works on her work by herself only. I don't have to sit a lot with her. If she has any questions, she calls me. So that time it's the only time I have to attend to her. And now he's, he's busy creating something. This is Play-Doh. So he usually plays with it most of the time. When um, he's not doing any other activity, he's self-engaging with these. These are very good for even fingers and hand muscles. You know, they are using their fingers and uh, this thing to mold and create something. Here you know, it comes with different, different kind of things where you can uh, put the Play-Doh inside and create a lot of things. So this is another way to you know help them. So that's all from me. I hope you enjoyed this small vlog. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel. Be a part of our beautiful family.